This is I Love You, Lord, in the key of F. I love this song. I sing it to my babes all the time. Even when they're still sick or not feeling good or whatever, I still love just singing it to them. Hope you have a lot of fun with this one. Make sure to stop the video. And if you click on the description below, you can print out the chord sheet that I have prepared for you and you can uh, follow along with me. All right, so in this key of F, a lot of people don't like to play with it, especially uh, guitarists, but it's so beautiful in this song. So give it a give it a try. All right, so we have F, G minor, B flat, and C. And let's see, I think that's it. Okay, so pretty easy. Four chords, right? F, C, G minor, and B flat. So let's go, let's teach you the F, because you probably know where F is, or at least most of you probably will. Uh, look for the group of three. And the F is going to be to the left of those three black notes, okay? And then we have F, A, C. That's an F major chord, okay? If we move up one set of notes, we're in the G position, right? C, D, E, F, G. And a G minor looks like this. G, B flat, D, okay? Kind of has a little bit of a sad sound. Minors, minor chords do. Um, and this is a shape of a triangle. If you can kind of imagine that being a triangle, maybe that would help you. Um, here's G major and G minor. Okay, so G minor kind of has that sound, beautiful sound to it really. Um, and then we have C chord, which if you look for this group of two black notes, you'll find the C to the left of that. Play every other note, C, E, G. Okay, and that is it. Oh, B flat, sorry. <laughs> I'm all over the place. B flat, D, F. Okay? And this makes this curved line. If you kind of do black, white, white, black, white, white, it's kind of a curved line there. Okay? B flat. All right. So um, let's figure out what the left hand is going to be doing. Um, I would like to put thumb on C for the left hand and just leave this hand the whole song, and that'll help kind of simplify it. So we have C chord with our C in the bass. That's how we're going to line those up. Okay? F chord to F in the bass, G minor, remember that's that triangle with the black note in between, G minor there, and G in the bass, and then B flat is that curve line. I sometimes use fingers one, two, five. You could do one, three, five if you'd rather, whatever feels comfortable for you. Okay, so that's that B flat with B flat in the bass, this black note. All right, so let's talk about the rhythm to bring the two hands together. It's pretty simple. It's written in 4-4 time. So I'm going to use a rhythm called together right or 1-2 uh, to two ratio. So it sounds like this. Together, right, together, right, together, right, together, right. Okay, you could practice that on the B flat. Just to get that nice marching rhythm, it's just a great place to start with your songs, okay? All right, I'm going to sing through it so you can hear how it sounds. It's a pretty short song, and then you can, um, then we'll break it up into some simple steps, okay? So um, I wrote the chord above the word or the syllable in which it kind of changes, if that helps you. Um, so we're just going to break through it, kind of just step by step. We're starting out with that F chord. I love you, Lord. And I move up to the G minor, pick up that black note in the middle. Lift my Take 
Go back to the beginning if you need a little help. You can always just play your right hand by itself and remove the left hand until you kind of get used to these new chords. Like I said, key of F is often a bit tricky, um, but it's totally doable. You can do it. I believe in you. Have a lot of fun. Play with me. I love 